2022 in Atlanta, Georgia with the beautiful seven in this all nice orange, honey. Thank you, honey. How you doing? I am amazing. But listen, let's talk about this music. As a female R&B artist out here, how difficult is it to be able to just get bigger, get more respected and be able to break through this industry? Um, I think it's all difficult. But you know what? You just got to have like endurance. You got to first, you, gotta, you have to love what you do. When you love what you do, nothing's gonna stop you. Stay focused. I always say, run with your head down, have tunnel vision, plan your shit out. You know what I mean? Like, really take your time and um, you know, make sure that you love your end product because that's very important. At least for me, it's very important that I love my shit. I love that. But let's talk about the end product. Anything coming up that we should be looking out for? Yes, I just put out a new single. It's called 23, and um, it's fun. It's different. It's tempo. It's up. I call it 23 because I just want everybody to be the 2-3 version of themselves. When you think about 23, you think about Jordan. You're thinking about being the greatest version of you. Yeah, yeah. So, 2-3. Everybody 2-3. I feel 2-3. You know what I mean? I'm 2-3. We all, listen, we're 2-3, baby. 2-3. Listen, baller alert with 7 Streeter. Enjoy tonight. What are you excited for we get on this One Music Fest stage? Man, I'm not going to hold you. I just had an amazing set over there, and it was so much fun. And they sang every single lyric. They were loud. They had some harmonies in the crowd. I would put that mic out there, and they were singing their little hearts out. It's just, it's good Atlanta energy, you know what I mean? And um, I just love it. It was so much fun. So thank you, One Music Fest, for having me, because I had the time of my life. Yes, thank you. Bree Harmon here with Baller Alert.